Section 3 The one-dollar bill is the most ubiquitous piece of paper in America, says Brooklyn-based artist Mark Wagner. It is a ripe material, intaglio printed on sturdy linen stock, covered in decorative filigree, and steeped in symbolism and concept. Blade and glue transform it, reproducing the effects of tapestries, paints, engravings, mosaics, and computers, striving for something bizarre, beautiful, or unbelievable, the foreign in the familiar. Wagner cuts up dollar bills into a variety of basic shapes, images, and textures, reducing them to their molecular makeup. These basic parts get reformed to become the building blocks for constructing a new world. Wagner says there are hundreds of little techniques in this process, ones he has refined over his 20-year dollar-cutting career. Each piece contains multiple concepts, destruction, sacrifice, commerce, and others that Wagner hopes his viewers will think about. In homes across the United Kingdom, Ryan's art can be found in the form of hanging wall prints, mugs, plates, calendars, and even tea towels and pocket squares. The intricate details and personal messages reveal universal themes. Death, loss, love, longing, earning Ryan growing popularity among the public. Ryan began making paper-cut art because he wished to create in a simpler way. He works with a single sheet of paper using only silhouette. He enjoys being able to strip things down to a more basic level and concentrate on the emotional side of the work, focusing on message over image. Ryan draws on smooth 70 GSM cream-colored paper with a fine pencil, correcting with an eraser repeatedly and redrawing. Then he cuts the drawn shape using a scalpel. Once the paper cut is complete, he finishes it with spray paint. Tord Bunti is known for his expression of romanticism in contemporary design. Based in London, he creates elements for everyday life that are exciting and uplifting to live with and to be around. Bunti has a strong interest in storytelling, nature, decoration, materials, and technology, and his work has an experimental approach. The luxury of a crystal chandelier is easily communicated through paper in these site-specific pieces. Cut Up, Cut Out, on exhibit June 26th through August 23rd. Visit MaslinMuseum.org for more information. <laughs>